I really think it's a new age, and in part because uh, what had to happen in the 90s uh, did happen. There was a lot of you know, positive economic growth that was uh, aided and abetted by government policy and huge amounts of um, advancement for people up and down the income scale, minorities and others. Uh, in the Obama administration, the biggest expansion of health care that could happen. But it wasn't until the pandemic that I think a truly working majority of Americans crossing party lines, as we've seen, because of the approval that Republicans and independent uh, voters are giving Biden, suddenly understood in a clear way that, you know what, there's lots of times when we need the government and we've been exposed uh, as uh, lacking in the kind of investments and support uh, that we as Americans should be providing each other with the government as our partner. And I'm thrilled that um, you know President Biden is taking advantage of this moment to try to push the agenda as far as possible. I think both uh, you know Presidents Obama and Clinton did too, but they were more constrained given you know what the climate was politically uh, during their administrations. So yes, I think it builds on a lot of what did happen in prior Democratic administrations, but it also goes further. And it can go further because people understand, uh, guess what, you know, we kind of were failed by our government for four years when we confronted uh, one of the worst uh, healthcare crises, economic crises that uh, our country has seen.